Today I wanted to stop by Marie-Hélène Tayac because she's in my book, Chic in Paris, a picture of Marie-Hélène and uh, she's lovely, lovely looking, a, lo a lovely person and she's very neat. <laughs> what I really thought was incredible in, in my book was her closet, which is very organized. Um, but the book is about personal style and and not so much about her jewelry. Uh, but today I'm coming here to pay a visit to her. I wanted to show um, uh, in a stone because I'm, my feeling is for bolder things. And of course, uh, you know, bolder in gold, I have a mix too uh, over the top. While stone still has a lightness to it because it's transparent. So this is what I've been working on. I'm also wearing one. And there are rubelites, which are beautiful quality of tourmaline and tourmaline. Ruby light is like the shocking pink so it's quite rare. Wow. What's the feeling Ooh, of this one? What is this? Well, it's Mickey Quartz. Quartz? Yeah. You see, I've All of it's pink. quartz. All of it is quartz. With, with diamonds. Uh, with uh, aquamarine. It's a diamond sautoir. And the stones are, um, are drilled. So when you have it on, you don't see any of the setting. So it's like, a, it's really flowing. It's like water. This is gorgeous. Try it on. Try okay. It this is, you know, I'm not really into, you know, classic, classic I'm not diamonds. Into classic diamond. No, it's. Okay. But if you have something like this, you can wear it and you know in the I, day. Yeah, I wear it all the time. It's, it's so light. Oh, it's so light, but it's 75 carats of diamonds. Oh, it's 75 carats of diamonds. <laughs> it's so light and it's so expensive. <laughs> because it's just the stones. Oh, beautiful. Oldest candle maker in the world. It's it's since um, 1643, and um, and so it's a beautiful company. And my husband just relaunched uh, the whole history, and they never stopped to do candle for church or I don't know for Lelise for Versailles, but they never had their own line, and so we decided to do this scented candle line and the idea is more about you know it's not perfume it's about smell and it's about the way you know a place you saw there is something called Roi Soleil which is smelling like uh, like Versailles like the wooden floor of Versailles mm -hmm. there is something called Carmelite which is like an old old castle a bit like humidity mm -hmm. and so this is what the idea and it's very popular and we have also this um, what we call pillar candles pillar yeah pillar candles with a camé with oh, notes okay. like Calme, so there is a lot of different ones and a lot of color. And also we decided to do something that, you know, before sculpture were in, in wax mm -hmm. also. Mm -hmm. And so we are just choosing very famous uh, sculpture like L'Esclave de Jean-Baptiste Carpo. Oh, that was fun! Yes. Oh, I'm here with my, my dearest friend Rosita. We're doing a little shopping and mm -hmm. it was great to see Marie-Hélène de Tayac who's just a doll, a doll. And then Rosita said, come next door, let's go to this, this candle store. It's the best in the whole world called Cire Tourdon. And so I learned something new, thanks to Rosita. My, my pleasure. <laughs> and uh, so now we're going to go have a little tea at the Café Fleur. Fleur. <laughs> no. <laughs> 